This is my first graduation ceremony, and at the age of 58, um, <laughs> okay, so you know now, it's never, ever too late. But my life started off, as very sweetly uh, mentioned, not very auspiciously and certainly not academic and certainly nothing to do with engineering other than, of course, uh, mending my motorbike. Um, but beyond that, actually, one of the things that I've learned and one of the things I've been so excited and impressed by this university is in many ways you've got different ages, a super diversity. It's London, which I actually think is one of the most exciting, diverse communities and has all its strength from that. But it's also your values around creativity and around innovation and around excellence that really matters. So I've tried very hard to always follow my passions and I hope you will too. Um, sometimes that takes you down strange routes, sometimes it takes you to new opportunities. But do consider your future as being in your hands, not necessarily determined by careers, not necessarily determined by sort of linear trajectories. And I've always tried to do that all my life. I'm very much involved, as I said, in diversity. And actually what we do need, and particularly in engineering, is diversity of thought, diversity of lived experience. And when we look at climate change, which is something that should be absolutely at the forefront of everything that you're doing, you are the answer to climate change. Engineering, all sorts of different, in many ways, um, scientific uh, discoveries and, and work is absolutely crucial. But may I suggest, as, a, as engineers, do talk to social scientists. Do talk to data and computing. Do understand issues around construction, fabric of, of our built environment. This is a moment for us to be really diverse, to be diverse in attitude, but to be diverse in skills, bringing together teams of different practices, different experiences. I am really, really proud and quite taken aback to be um, an honorary doctorate here. Um, and I just want to say what a great honour it is to be part of a really wonderful, inspiring and dynamic community, a sort of family. So thank you all so much.